Alright, hello everyone and welcome back. I didn't expect to come back to this, but I am honestly thinking of closing this down now. Uh, if you look at my inventory, very recently I have uh, been subdued by zombies and tossed into lava. I have lost diamonds, I have lost iron, I have lost a ton of supplies. And I don't know about other players that play this, but the way I generally tend to play this, I play this for serious real Z's, I play this for keeps, and the fact that I completely lost a shit ton of resources kinda leaves me not wanting to play that map anymore. So I'm really am. Uh, tell me otherwise, but as far as I'm concerned, I'm really just not got my heart in it anymore. After being so brutally robbed of, like, everything I had just been mining for, uh, and just being completely screwed over, I just don't have the heart in me to actually continue playing on this level anymore, and would rather just start over from scratch somewhere else where I haven't lost a shitload of stuff. Again, uh, for you viewers, tell me if you think otherwise, I should do otherwise, but that's kind of the way I feel about it. Food. Um, now let's cook the steaks really quick. Last couple steaks I have. Oh, there's actually some more iron in here. Just left some iron behind to cook. But yeah, I lost like well over half a stack of iron. I had lost four diamonds I just mined. I just found a dungeon area with a spawner, took care of the spawner, I had it back up from the zombies and was trying to deal with them. And then a lava pool apparently just swallowed me whole, even though I was pretty sure there wasn't a lava pool behind me. But... That fucked everything. I have no levels, I have none of my gear anymore. Actually, I need to craft me another shield. Just happen to think. Board and board. All right, as soon as that's done, we'll go. Uh, I want at least, aside from announcing the fact that I'll probably be moving on from Rosa because I got fucked. Maybe I'll come back to Rosa someday, but I don't think it'll be anytime soon. I'd rather just wipe the map and start refresh somewhere else. Hey, matter of fact, actually, if you can think of uh, any interesting world names you might want me to try out, uh, put them in the comments below as well. Maybe make a series on just exploring uh, different worlds by name. That actually wouldn't be a half bad idea. Anyway, one of the things I promised before leaving uh, was to go over to the witch's hut here. <clears throat> it's pretty much just straight out there. As far as I can tell from a distance, it's practically right out in the open. Be able to see it as soon as we get to the other side of these trees. And yeah, we're doing this at night. It's a little bit dangerous, but I can still see around, so I'm not too spooked. Yep, need to back up. A zombie coming up behind me, and another zombie and a stupid spider in front of me. Oh, apparently in bog. Okay, yeah, I can see the witch's hut from here. At least the rest of this is pretty safe. I need some rotten flesh so I don't use up all my meat just trying to get over there. Rough fish will leave you hungry, but it'll at least allow you to heal. That's all I really want right now is to have full hearts by the time I get there.
here we are. Take that. And that. No, that's just a post sitting there in the window. And sunrise. No more cauldron for you. I can't remember how difficult it is to make a cauldron, but I do recall that most people prefer to steal it from a witch rather than to make it themselves because apparently it's a lot of iron. At least for early games, it's a lot of iron. Depends upon how much you're finding, I guess. Yeah, I didn't want to leave all my limb posts there. Just to try and get up into that thing. So, back to the house we go. There we are. So, where to put the cauldron? Let's put it right next to this. did promise was to do some exploring in the basement. I have my stakes on here. Move that all out of the way for right now. And actually what I want to do now is I want to at least have a look at that uh, little dungeon pocket that I found and have a look and see what those zombies were protecting. So what I was doing was I realized that there's mountains on the other side of the village over there. So I've been digging this tunnel. And as you can see, the tunnel goes quite a ways. Uh, here's one of the few times I went to the surface off to the side. I've only dug to the surface I think twice in this entire tunnel. get up here high enough, you can try a spot, there it is, you can spot the village over there. And actually you can see just over that tree line there's another post over there. That's the other time I've come to the surface, which means I was almost to the mountains even. I'd almost dug my way there. A nice little underground freeway. Of course zombies have to come out in mobs and push me into lava that I didn't know was even there and that fucks up everything. So that would be the second time I went to the surface right there. I think the dungeon I found was the hour here. Oh, you know what? I know what happened. I completely missed actually going over this and I didn't completely cover the lava so I fell it in. Oh, no, no, it was over this way. Yeah, I didn't know there was lava over here. Yeah, this had to have been the way I died. I'm pretty sure. Well, what did we find up here? It doesn't make up for the missing diamonds. Though, well, we did find a name tag. Huh, pumpkin seeds. Red, some more TNT, and a couple pieces of horse armor now that I've actually found any horses ever around here of late. <sighs> oh, here's another one. Let's light up this whole thing here. That's probably why there's so many zombies up in here. There's a nice little off tunnel for them, so they could just group. Oh, another music CD. More bones. More string. More pumpkin seeds. Some rotten flesh for some reason. A piece of iron. A couple pieces of coal and some iron horse armor. 
See, some of those wouldn't be bad, but they're not worth the destruction of four diamonds and half a stack of iron, which are all now down in there somewhere. Must have been mining and completely missed the fact that I had them there. I'm not sure why else those blocks would have been there. So I'm pretty sure I didn't fall into that one, but then again, actually, maybe I did back up into that one, maybe. I can't remember. I could have sworn I backed that way, but it may have been that I backed up into this, and it doesn't matter either way because pretty much everything's gone. I got all my pointless cobble and my gold back. Trying to mine over this way. Just hoping that I'd get more diamonds and eventually into that mountainside. Well. So much for that. I guess I one other thing I promised was to check out the cave system I found on my way down here. So I'm gonna go back to that and I'll see you over there. Alright, back up into here. Is that way? Yeah, it was this way. Yeah, look at that. It spawned somewhere up there. Now where is it there? Be a team killing fucktard. You skeletons are stupid. That spider is going crazy trying to figure out where I am. I'm right here. I have no idea where you are though. You seem to be caught behind a wall somewhere. So why you think you can get at me is beyond me. Because there's a spider spawner in here. Another dungeon? Vicious. Yo. That's enough of you bugs. Oh, <sighs> bones. Some red. Some rock flesh. Not 
piece of iron, and cap disc. Hmm. I guess not. I thought there might have been another chest half buried underneath that, but I don't see anything. Hi, Creeper. That was pointless. Um, alright. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the big hole over here, too, that I was seeing from down there. Anything else to explore up here? Other than more creepers? Delving deeper. Wow. This cave system. I found a completely second gorge. Oh my word. <clears throat> I'm actually out of torches. That's how much this thing has just continued to grow. Um, yeah, I can make some more. Caves I've ever seen in a while. That is quite a oh, fuck you, bullshit. Yep, and this is exactly the reason why I declare that I don't want to play this map anymore. Because now this has got to be at least the third time this map in particular has bullshitted me to death, and then the second time by dropping dropping a creeper literally on my head out of nowhere. <sighs> yeah, that's the kind of thing that just really kills it for me. So again, uh, unless you guys really think I should stay, I might give it another try, otherwise as far as I'm concerned, I think we're done here. Thank you all for watching, and if you have any other world suggestions, please let me know and I'll try them out. See you all next time.